Here is a picture from a shot by Jay Hines. Shot by Jay Hines. No time for the foolery. No time. We are not the same. Nah, that shit ain't cool to me. Just went to my guy for like two or three peas. Nigga, you know that ain't none. That ain't new to me. Yeah, nigga, look up to me. Yeah, I'm influenced and got speak they language fluently. Might send them after you. That's for your jewelry. Then two white free trying to talk with you. What's going on, everybody? This is Camera Plus Crew Media, a new segment that we will now be doing, and it will be posted to our Instagram, YouTube, and uh, today I have a special guest. But first off, I am your host, Noob Shooter, as known on Instagram as that, but my real name is Jay Carter. I am happy to be here hosting the Camera Plus Crew Media new show. With that being said, let's go and get on to it. You know, we're all about what the creative process is. I have it for you guys today. Shot by Jay Hines himself. It's been a long time since we've caught up with him. We interviewed him one time. He gave us some tips and some pointers on what not to do, but that's been about a year ago. And now that we're starting back with this new show, we'd like to hit him up and ask him what's good. So, you know, happy to have you as the first guest, right? Happy to have you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. So, you know what I'm saying? First off, starting these days, what is your creative process like nowadays? You shot so many videos. Too, too many, too many. I think this year, uh, well, last year now, it's beginning of the new year. Yeah. Uh, 80 videos, somewhere around there. 80 last videos. Year. Yeah. A lot of, a lot of sleep was nice, but I mean, with, with most of those, pretty much just the creative process is first of all getting with the client, seeing what they want, everything like that. Make sure you have that in mind first, and then putting my own little spin on it. You know, most people that come to me. They're like, you know, I want you to do your thing. You know, I might want this in there, but I want you to just, you know, put your sauce on it, do whatever you want to do. So, um, pretty much after that, you know, watch, I, I watch a lot of music videos. Like last time I think we were talking about that. Yeah. I watch, I'm weird. I watch music videos with no sound, just to, just to watch like the effects cute. and stuff like that. So, um, after that, you know, I like to study pretty much. That's what I call it. Watch all the videos I can try to find something that's, the same kind of vibe to it, or like that can be inspired and turned into something new, you know, because yeah. that's what I like to do. So after that, ain't nothing to it, but to, but to do it, you know, so. So as you can you know, see, set. that's his creative process right there. And we're gonna show you a couple of his videos. So check this out, we'll be right back. Real, I, got a hoe. Okay. I don't do beef, I'm kicking your door. You listen to young boy, I know he a hoe. I just bought a sniper, don't want to your dough. Shot by Jay. Real they blowing up your fucking roof in your coop. Mob stick, yeah, the same in it too. Honey rounds, but I only need two. It's a sticker. I'm stuttered, I'm moving. I need your finger. Might shoot up your school. Crazy nigga. Don't care about no rules. Start. What are you shooting with nowadays? It seems that you've become a master of whatever you're shooting with. Um, yeah, so uh, I got the Sony A7 II. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm about to push this to its limits right now. Looking to upgrade soon, but it's, it's a really good, solid camera and everything like that. I love it so far. It, it does what it needs to do. I love the low light. Um, as you can see from a lot of videos, I like low light, you know, real dark with colored lights and stuff like that. So it's, it's real good for that. Who are like your top inspirations when it comes down to like shooting videos or people who you looked up to um, when, uh, you know, before you started shooting videos and even after? Okay. Um, biggest inspirations, probably uh, AZ Productions. Uh, I just love the, the clean look at his videos. Another person, um, his name is JMP. As you already know JMP on Instagram, I think. That's one of my biggest inspirations that I pull the videos for. He's also real clean. And then uh, the guy that really got me started into music videos, his name is Nassiker. Um I think he goes by a different name now. I can't remember what it is. But um, the talk by Playboy Cardi video, once I saw that, it was over with. I was like, I need to learn how to do that shit, so. That was a style, you know what I'm saying, a song. What would you compare your photography to if there was a song to compare it to? Ooh, that's a hard question. Um, I know. I think uh, Double Up by Nipsey Hussle. Yeah. It's just a clean song. Like, it's just real clean. It's just soothing and stuff like that. Um, I'd like to think, at least with some of my shoots, the lower energy ones. That's that's why I compare it to just real clean and you know it's beautiful. I like I think I make art. I like. To do that, so. What's your favorite like video you ever shot? Favorite. 
favorite video I ever shot. Uh, the Jacquees one is up there yeah. right now. I love that one. Um, Birds and Bees by my homeboy. Shout out Misfit. Uh, shout out King Bema. Shout out. Uh, uh, dang. Any artists you're looking like to work with, and I know you and Trap a lot have an extensive history. Uh, little Trap a lot, yeah, I, I'm actually a big Trap. fan when you, when you shoot videos for him, yeah. and I just seen y'all recently do some pictures. Uh -huh. Is there a video coming? Yes, there's definitely a video in the works. The pictures I took uh, was from the shoot we did. We did that like last week, so that's definitely dropping soon, like the next couple weeks. Shout out my boy, Little Trap man. You know? What artists are you looking to work with? Um, as far as like bigger artists, um, definitely want to work with Lil Nudie. That's that's one of my goals. Work with him. Really, dream artist would be me. You know. Yeah. I just you know I, I fuck with me. I love I love his vibe and shit like that. So I feel like you know we make some fire together. Um, still want to do some more stuff with uh, Lil Likey. You know we've been working for a long. He's looking for a big year. And uh, another one is Fado, his his homeboy, um, my homeboy too. You know, shout out Nick, but him too. I, I fuck with his stuff. So. Um, speaking of that, how do you feel about the baby taking Lil Lanky's "What's Up with It" beat and incorporating it on the <laughs> song with him and Quavo? I don't think a lot of people know this, but if you actually, we can go back and compare mm -hmm. the time "What's Up with It" video dropped. So when the Kirk drop, which yeah. dropped later on in the fall, and they have the exact same beat. What's up with it? What's up with it? 150 shots is coming at your feet. What's up with that raw shit? Raw. Turn it up, I'ma sit in the car. Turn yeah. me up. If you turn off your lights, you gonna see me at night. Now, how do you feel about that? Ooh, man. I mean, shit like that happen in the industry all the time. You know, bigger artists will take from somebody. It's like, it's not gonna get too much attention if, if they take. Little, little whoever's beat from over there and stuff like that. I mean, man, ah, that is gotta, crazy. Gotta get that copyright. Gotta, gotta For buy sure. beat stuff like that. Just protect yourself from shit, shit like that. I'll be telling these artists all the time. Yeah, um, shout out King Bema. Shout out Misfit. Uh, shout out my boy Ashton Ron to the Birds and Bees video. I think that's that's one of my favorite ones of last year. Um, it's a lot, man. It's so I shot so many videos last year, and it's like I try and put my heart and soul and into each and every one of them. It's, I can't even really pick one. I love them all. So. No, I feel that. I like really feel that. Shot by Jay Hines. We just had him right here on the interview. Any poses you want to show people that you use when you're like out shooting videos? Like, what's um, that? <laughs> I mean the the basic, you know. Everybody, I like low angle shit like that. So my back gonna be hurt when I'm an old man because I like you know getting getting low. Probably gonna be lower than with the camera. So, but you know getting real low makes the artist look bigger than he is in real life. You know shows power and shit like that. So that's I think that's one of my go-to ones. Um, other than that, I mean, really anything you want to do, man. I can't really tell you how to do your job stuff. Like, I ain't got the secret formula. I just know what looks good for me. So. And this has been a Camera Plus Crew Media and Magazine interview. We hope to have many, you know, more of you guys on here. Make sure you guys follow our guy, Shot by Jay Hines. His YouTube is pretty popping as well and has great content. And make sure you follow our YouTube as well. It is Camera Plus Crew. Just type it in anywhere. We're the only people named that. Stick around for more interviews. Yes, sir.